Imagine you're throwing the ultimate digital party. Your modem is the bouncer at the door, checking IDs and controlling who gets in, while your router is the charismatic host, introducing guests to each other and making sure everyone has a great time. Together, they're the unsung heroes of your online experience, working tirelessly behind the scenes to keep you connected to the vast digital universe. What is a modem? A modem, modulator demodulator, is a device that connects your home or office network to the wider internet. It serves as the gateway between your local network and your internet service provider, ISP. The primary function of a modem is to modulate and demodulate signals. When sending data, the modem modulates digital signals from your devices into analog signals that can be transmitted over cable, telephone lines, or other infrastructure. When receiving data, the modem demodulates incoming analog signals back into digital signals that your devices can understand. Essentially, the modem translates the digital language of computers into signals that can travel long distances and vice versa. This allows your devices to communicate with servers and other systems across the internet. Types of modems There are several types of modems, depending on the type of internet connection. Cable modems used with cable internet services, connecting via coaxial cable. DSL modems, used with digital subscriber line services, connecting via telephone lines. Fiber optic modems, used with fiber internet, connecting via fiber optic cables. Satellite modems, used to connect to satellite internet services. Key features of modems. One port, to connect to the internet service line, LAN port to connect to a router or computer, indicator lights, show connection status and activity, coaxial or phone line connector, depending on the type of internet service. What is a router? A router is a networking device that forwards data packets between computer networks. In a home or small office setting, a router typically connects the local network to the internet and allows multiple devices to share that internet connection. The primary functions of a router include creating a local area network, LAN, routers allow multiple devices to connect and communicate with each other, IP address assignment, routers assign local IP addresses to devices on the network, traffic direction, routers determine the best path for data to travel between devices and to slash from the internet, network security, many routers include built-in firewalls and other security features to protect the network, Wi-Fi broadcasting, Wireless routers create Wi-Fi networks, allowing devices to connect without cables. Types of routers Wired routers connect devices via Ethernet cables. Wireless routers provide Wi-Fi connectivity. Mesh routers use multiple access points to cover larger areas. Key features of routers Multiple Ethernet ports for wired connections. Wi-Fi antennas for wireless connectivity. USB ports for connecting external drives or printers. Administration interface for configuring network settings. Key differences between modems and routers. Primary function. Modem connects your network to the internet, translating signals between digital and analog formats. Router creates a local network and manages traffic between devices and the internet. Internet connectivity. Modem brings internet service into your home or office. Router distributes the internet connection to multiple devices. Network creation. Modem does not create a network. Router creates and manages a local area network, LAN, device connections. Modem typically connects to one device, usually a router. Router can connect multiple devices simultaneously. IP address assignment. Modem uses a public IP address assigned by the ISP. Router assigns private IP addresses to devices on the local network. Security features. Modem generally has minimal built-in security features. Router often includes a firewall, encryption and other security measures. Wireless capabilities. Modem usually does not provide Wi-Fi, some combo units do. Router often includes Wi-Fi capabilities for wireless connections. Network management. Modem, limited network management capabilities. Router offers various network management tools, for example, COS parental controls. 
replacement frequency. Modem, generally replaced less frequently, often when changing ISPs or upgrading service. Router, may be replaced more often to take advantage of new features or improve performance. ISP involvement. Modem, often provided or specified by the ISP. Router, can usually be chosen independently by the user. Our modems and routers work together. In a typical home or small office network setup, the modem and router work in tandem. The modem connects to the internet service line, cable, DSL, fiber, etc., and communicates with the ISP's network. The modem translates incoming analog signals from the ISP into digital data. The modem passes this digital data to the router via an Ethernet cable. The router creates a local network and assigns private IP addresses to connected devices. The router manages traffic between devices on the local network and between the local network and the internet. When sending data to the internet, the process reverses. The router sends data to the modem, which modulates it into analog signals to be sent over the ISP's infrastructure. This setup allows multiple devices to share a single internet connection while benefiting from the router's network management and security features. Modem Router Combo Devices Some devices combine the functions of a modem and router into a single unit. These are often called gateways or modem router combos. They offer several advantages. Space saving. One device instead of two. Simplified setup. No need to connect separate devices, potentially lower cost, may be cheaper than buying separate devices. However, combo devices also have some drawbacks. Less flexibility, can't upgrade modem and router separately, potential for overheating. More functions in one device generate more heat, may be harder to troubleshoot. Issues could be related to either modem or router functions. Choosing between a modem and router. When setting up a home or small office network, you'll typically need both a modem and a router, or a combo device. Here are some factors to consider. When to choose a separate modem and router. You want more control over your network setup. You prefer to upgrade components separately. You need specific features in either the modem or router. Your ISP requires or recommends a specific modem model. When to choose a modem router combo. You have limited space. You prefer a simpler setup process. Your ISP offers a good quality combo device. You don't need advanced router features. Maintaining and upgrading your network. To keep your network running smoothly, consider the following. Regularly update firmware for both modem and router. Monitor your internet speeds to ensure you're getting the service you're paying for. Replace your modem if you upgrade your internet service plan. Upgrade your router every few years to take advantage of new features and improve performance. Secure your network by using strong passwords and enabling encryption. Troubleshooting common issues. When experiencing internet connectivity problems, it's important to identify whether the issue is with the modem or the router. Modem issues. No internet connection for any device. Modem lights indicate a problem. For example, no signal light. ISP reports an outage or account issue. Router issues. Some devices can connect while others can't. Wi-Fi network not appearing. Slow speeds on Wi-Fi, but not on wired connections. Basic troubleshooting steps often include restarting both the modem and router, checking all cable connections, verifying settings in the router's administration interface, contacting your ISP for modem-related issues. Conclusion. While modems and routers often work together to provide internet access and create home or office networks, they serve distinct purposes. Modems act as the gateway to the internet, translating signals between your local network and your ISP's infrastructure. Routers, on the other hand, create and manage local networks, allowing multiple devices to share an internet connection and communicate with each other. Understanding the differences between these devices can help you make informed decisions when setting up or troubleshooting your network. Whether you choose separate devices or a combo unit, ensuring that both the modem and router functions are working correctly is key to maintaining a fast, reliable, and secure internet connection.